this issue is still happening. This war is still ongoing. A very creative story. It's really important issue about identity. The selection of the images were impeccable. In my region, you can see like we have some special uh, topic from the region. The civil con conflict still in Myanmar, the drug war in uh, Philippines. But we also have a lot of uh, similar team with other region about like, identifying about climate change, uh, protect wildlife. This photo is showing the people who are really in the front line now in the civil war in Myanmar. In this photo, we see a soldier carrying a comrade on his back, on this field, in this plane in Myanmar. It's a reminder that this issue is still happening. This war is still ongoing. It might have moved um, from the streets of the images that we saw last year, but this, is, this conflict is still going. It's still damage to lives. The picture is really focused on the people who are in the front line to can see more the serious of the war. This story is about a group of the old uh, transgender um, in Manila. They do a show together, helping each other to have money and support in like daily life. It's really like the question about to create your space, space when you can be yourself and uh, where you can trust people. And I think like on the question of identity, it's so important really like to be yourself and to be supported in like in the all levels, like absolutely in the all levels, like it's a it's really important issue. But here, like you can see, like through the color, so colorful, to all the moment that they really enjoy the light. The long term project is about the consequence of the drug war in the Philippines. That's what happened in kind of like five years already. This is one of those cases where the selection of the images were impeccable in showing all sorts, the, all the different aspects of this very complex long-term story. The dyad of the image of the boy with the candle and the woman at the funeral shows the different ways in which different social economic groups are mourning the dead of this atrocities being committed in the name of the drug war. We really respect this long-term project because we can really see the connection, the very close uh, between the photographer and all of the family who appear in the in the story. This project uh, is very interesting one when the photographer used the infrared to tell a very creative story about very old topic that about flooding in Australia. It was a very creative way to look into it, grabs your attention and makes you want to understand what's happening. And the use of the infrared technology specifically for this case, we all felt that it really worked well. It's so colorful, beautiful. I felt it was a very refreshing look into a very serious and uh, important problem.